A local father forced to drink rainwater in Puerto Rico to survive after Hurricane Maria is now back in the arms of his family tonight. Yeah. ABC Action News anchor Paul Legrone is here with the emotional reunion. Yeah, Paul. Happy to bring you this one, guys. Juan Feliciano, he's a U.S. veteran who lives in St. Petersburg, and he finally made it back home over the weekend after he got caught between two hurricanes in Puerto Rico. <laughs> Before Juan Feliciano got here, he was stuck there in the middle of Mother Nature's fury and struggling to escape the living hell that descended on Puerto Rico in the days after Hurricane Maria. Chaos, total chaos. Um, I don't know if we can handle that. We don't know if we can handle it. When his daughters, Yami Feliciano and Yanela Sierra, reached out to ABC Action News last month about their father's plight, they were worried if their dad would make it out alive. A day feels like 10 days, four days feels like forever. The disabled U.S. Army veteran who lives in St. Petersburg got stranded on the island after he went there to check on his property following Hurricane Irma. And then Maria hit. Caught between two storms, trapped in a dark, powerless home, and forced to drink rainwater to survive. It's difficult being here, and um, you have you have this sense of guilt laying on your bed, knowing that you have shelter and you have food, while your family, friends, 3.4 million people are pretty much without shelter. After days of phone calls and emails and canceled flights, finally a breakthrough and a boarding pass for a JetBlue flight back home. Come on, home again. Juan Feliciano, a veteran, a father, a survivor. And a deserving homecoming for him. The daughters tell me tonight they plan to have an early Thanksgiving dinner this year, Puerto Rican style, and they certainly have a lot to be thankful for.